Hello, and welcome to the presentation of this STM32 Nucleo 64 board, Nucleo G071RB. It covers the main features of the Nucleo board dedicated to the STM32 G0 series. The demonstration software included with this Nucleo board will allow you to become more familiar with this new low-consumption microcontroller. The STM32G0 Nucleo board offers everything required for users to get started quickly and develop applications easily. This board enables a wide diversity of applications taking benefit from security and connectivity features. The STM32G0 Nucleo board comes with the STM32 Comprehensive Software HAL Library, together with various packaged software examples. It also embeds a debugger that helps you develop your own applications from the existing examples. Nucleo G071RB board is divided into two parts, the ST-Link part and the target MCU part. The ST-Link part is separable from the MCU part to reduce the board size. In this configuration, the MCU part is only powered by the V-in entry available on Morpho or Arduino connectors. And it is still possible to use the ST-Link part to program the main MCU using wires available on the ST-Morpho connectors. The Arduino connectivity support provides unlimited expansion capabilities with a large choice of specialized add-on boards. This board will help us to demonstrate STM32G0 functionality and versatility thanks to its large peripheral set. The STM32 Nucleo board offers the following features. STM32G0 in LQFP package, 32.768 kHz crystal, board expansion connectors enabling the user to access all STM32 IOs, Flexible power supply options, ST-Link, VBUS, or external sources. Onboard ST-Link, V2.1 debugger and programmer. USB link to host computer can be used for three purposes. Accessing mass storage information present in non-volatile memory. Transporting serial data to and from STM32G0, LPU art, over USB using virtual COM class. Transporting debug commands and responses to a host debugger. The board comes with comprehensive free software libraries and examples available with the STM32Cube MCU package. The following IDEs are supported. IR, Keel, GCC-based, and ARM Embed. The STM32G071RBT6 microcontroller features an ARM Cortex-M0 Plus core running at up to 64 MHz, 128 KB of flash memory, and 36 KB of RAM. It also features the following peripherals. One user LED shared with Arduino. One user and one reset push buttons. An embedded ST-Link V2.1 debugger and programmer to connect your favorite development tools. Note that many expansion boards compatible with Arduino specification can be plugged onto the STM32G0 Nucleo board. The discovery kit has five possible power supply sources. Five volt can be provided by the host computer connected through the USB cable plugged on the ST-Link connector. A jumper connecting pin, one and two of JP2 header must be present. 7 to 12 volt power supply can be connected to CN8 pin 8 and CN8 pin 24. A jumper connecting pin 3 and 4 of JP2 header must be present. External 5 volt power supply can be connected to CN9 pin 6. A jumper connecting pin 5 and 6 of JP2 header must be present. 5 volt can be provided by a USB charger. A jumper connecting pin 7 and 8 of JP2 header must be present. 3.3 volt power supply can be used provided that the ST-Link part is not powered or the solder bridges SB1 and SB19 are removed. The figure highlights the first possibility. Powering the MCU board from the host computer connected to ST-Link and shows the location of jumper 2, pin 1 and 2. 
This is the default setting. There are three ways to configure the pins corresponding to the low speed clock or LSE. The onboard oscillator, which is the default configuration, using an external oscillator via the PC14 pin, LSE not used. There are four ways to configure the pins corresponding to the external high speed clock or HSE. The MCO output from the ST link part, which is the default configuration, Using the HSC oscillator on board from X3 crystal, note that this crystal is not provided. With an oscillator from external PF0, PD0, and PH0, HSC not used. This slide describes the sequence enabling the user to take control of the STM32MCU from a host debugger. First, install the IDE, IR, Keel, or Eclipse. Second, the ST-Link driver will be installed automatically. It can also be installed separately. Third, download the STM32Nucleo firmware. Fourth, connect the STM32Nucleo board to the host PC by using a USB cable plugged into the CN1 connector. As a result, the green LED, LED3, lights up and the red LED, LED1, blinks. Fifth, press the user button B1. Sixth, observe that the blinking frequency of the green LED, LED4, changes by clicking on the button B1. This slide describes the default settings of the STM32G0 Nucleo board. The serial wire debug interface is by default active to enable debug from a host computer. 5 volt is the default power supply provided by the host computer through the USB cable. The reset input of the ST-Link is by default disconnected. Note that the ST-Link implements an autonomous power-up reset circuitry. The JP3 jumper, labeled IDD, allows the consumption of the STM32 microcontroller to be measured by removing the jumper and connecting an ampere meter. By default, the jumper is present and therefore, the STM32MCU is powered. Once unzipped, the file containing the Nucleo project examples has a directory named Nucleo G071RB. This directory contains the projects that can be run on the Nucleo G071RB board. These projects are ready to be run. The template project subfolder contains pre-configured projects with empty main function. The example project subfolder includes toolchain projects for each peripheral. The application subfolder includes a set of applications. The demonstration subfolder includes the demonstration firmware. STM32 Nucleo boards can easily be extended with a large number of specialized application hardware add-ons thanks to Arduino Uno Revision 3 and ST Morpho connectors. For example, USB Type-C and power delivery, motor control, LoRa and power consumption measurement boards are available. For more information on the STM32G0 Nucleo board, go to www.st.com/stm32nucleo.